I have a vlog mode. It is precisely exactly early in the morning and I'm loading up my freaking vehicle because it's concert day. I just heard a chicken. And I'm meeting freaking E, Mr. J himself. Man I've been listening to for, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight years. That's crazy. I hate loading up the car. Hey vlog, <laughs> this never feels good. We upgraded the vlog. One, I'm driving, not Alexandria. And I got a little thing to hold my freaking phone. And Alexandria's not here, dude. She's alive. We have a new friend. Her name is freaking McKinsey. Kinsey freaking dude. Freaking McKinsey. Introduce your, she, she like saw. I love saw. <laughs> okay, introduce yourself more than saw, dude. That's all I can think about right now is saw. I love saw. That's all you ever <laughs> think about, babe. <laughs> She's my, my each concert partner. She just learned about each. With that being said, give your history with each. Your personal rundown of how of your experience with Mr. J, Mr. J Hook Park. Um, Speak on that. Ash hit me up a few months ago and said, "Do you want to go see J with me?" And I said, "I don't know who that is, but so sure." So true. And then I listened to his discography, and now I'm prime sub him on Twitch. The natural but, order of things. Yeah. Well, I guess I should probably give my rundown with Jay. If you're a returning viewer to this channel, then you probably know that I made a video where I made a day six shirt. I wear it once a week. But I am my day through and freaking through, man. My bias is one pill. Don't tell Jay. But I've been listening to day six since 2015. So eight years, I was 13. Um, so this is kind of really important, and I'm really excited to see freaking Jay. I love Day6 and Eej, and I'm also sub to him on Twitch. Actually, it's probably run out. I got gifted a sub to Eej's Twitch, but I guess it doesn't really matter right now because he's not streaming because he's in fact on tour with Stephanie Poetry. We're on our way before, before we are, try again. We are on our way to Atlanta for the concert. But first, we're going to Starbucks. I have a caffeine addiction that never stopped. So don't echolocate me. It's gonna take a few hours to get there, but we're going to, oh, I like this song. We're going to Atlanta, but most importantly, there is a playlist for our entire drive. So if you wanna listen to the same music that we listen to on this drive, it's called J live on Twitch or on stage. Clap claps for the person who created it. And give it that great time. Thank you, thank you, it was me, it was me. Yeah, you can go listen to all the music that we're listening to currently on this drive. It's in the freaking description. Um, it's looking like a lot of girl groups, a lot of day six. No one's surprised with the two of us. Also your Spider-Man bag. <laughs> no. He might as well be a character in he this is. vlog. I love Spider-Man. We love Mark. We're going to Starbucks and then we can taunter on our freaking drive to the chicken coop. He's always chicken little in my heart. I will feel really bad if, if uh, Jay is watching this vlog because I will be slandering you, sir. Ooh, the lighting's good. Jay, get ready for about 20-ish minutes of you slander. Watch your steps, sir. Oh, I gotta switch lights. Do you wanna know who else had a pet pigeon? <laughs> that one guy. <laughs> Wait, what's his name? I don't know. Danny goes, I almost made a video about him. Oh, Mike Tyson. Yes! You're just like Mike Tyson. Danny dropped that video and I was like, oh my god, he's just like, Okay, pigeon owner. Tell about the pigeon. I used to have a pet pigeon named Floyd. Not a racing pigeon though. You're wasting its potential. How long has it been? That clock is wrong. It's been about an hour and a half. I look like I'm about to go to the Jersey Shore. I hate to tell you, dude. We're not going to Miami. We're going to the Jersey Shore. I would like it to be known that I have been watching the Jersey Shore. I watch it every Sunday with my sister and I have opinions. We've talked about our 17 biases. Let's disclose this information. You disclose your information. 17 bias list. It's half the group in June, Dino, Hoshi, DK, Mingyu, and sometimes Mingyu. Mine is Hoshi and no one's surprised. And then I'd say Dino and at this moment Mingyu, but all the time S groups. You can diagnose my issues <laughs> through my bias list for 17. And every other group. My biases and NCT are Heichan, Ranjin, Hindri, and Yuta. Yeah, that's what's up. This is an epic informational of sorts. You share your biases of the NCT so we can diagnose your issues. Just Johnny. <laughs> Johnny saw sex box. So true. We share biases in a few groups, actually. DXD, 17. Skiz. Skiz. Have you seen Skiz? I've seen the boys though. You don't care because you're not a boy stand. <laughs> Oh, 
K pop stand clear bag? No. <laughs> first, oh, the pimple is coming in. I need to put a Hello Kitty on. Let the first gas station stop. Then I'll make suitable phone propping locations at the gas station. Don't they know I'm vlogging? Where do I put my phone? <laughs> my car has kind of an issue with feeling gas. So that's why I'm hoping for the best. And if my car doesn't start, then I will cry. I feel like I became a zombie. Ayo, my freaking car turned on. <laughs> Epic win. <laughs> I applied a Hello Kitty because I have a pimple coming in and Jake's not allowed to know that I have acne. He has to think of a perfect little guy. Where I told you, it keeps repeating freaking songs, dude. So, after the concert, this is what you can expect. We return to the Airbnb, and he gave me 20 minutes after he arrived at the Airbnb, and my depression cycle for the next two months will begin. And because of that, we will watch Good Mythical Good Morning or Danny and Curtis play Minecraft. Betty is and I'm the driver, so I get to make rules. I'm dragging her here, so I guess I get to make a lot of the rules. You're just lucky that I don't make you watch me untamed. Speaking of which, <laughs> so I'm rewatching The Untamed with Gwen, and because uh, she's seen like some of it, but I've seen like almost all of it. <laughs> That's a whole other spiel, but you can see how it like changes throughout the show because. <laughs> Starbucks update, second Starbucks run. I got a, I swear kind of when I got scammed because this was a grande that afforded to a vintage cup. So, and then I wanted a sweet drink and not dirt water, which is my typical order. So I said, what's your favorite of the holiday lattes? And she said the sugar cookie and I could not refuse because I could not remember what the Sinjin Drowning official review of last year's holiday drinks was. My official review, I am Sinjin Drowning, I am Weston. Yay, I'm Kaylin. <laughs> I'm Weston and she's Kaylin. Kaylin Curry. I'm so Weston. Okay, whatever. <laughs> First sip. Okay. Yeah, this is fine. Taste of sugar cookie. Oh, what did you get? Green tea ice peach lemonade. It's good. <laughs> we continue driving. We're almost, almost meeting like two hours away from freaking Lanta. another Hello Kitty on because temple's still there. We have arrived at our Airbnb. It is really nice. We had complications for uh, two minutes because I'm dumb. We had to rapid fire get ready because it's like 2.51. The concert's at 6.30. I have time anxiety. We're gonna get there ASAP as freaking possible. I'm gonna get ready and I'm gonna brush my little teeth and then we're gonna meet Jay. We're gonna meet freaking Eve. Jay Park. Look at my Devtone shirt. I wasn't shaking in my boots before, but now I am. Corn nuts. <laughs> Fit check. Ayo. <laughs> I'm getting so increasingly nervous. Details, a uh, key to Airbnb, a raccoon, <laughs> and then soon my car keys. I'm so freaking nervous. I'm... And I hate to say this, but if I get bored in the line, I brought a book. 
I brought a book to read in the line. It is Lord of the Flies, and I am going to be reading Lord of the Flies in the line for each concert. I can't, I can't help it. What if I get freaking bored? Okay, um, I think we just gotta go. <laughs> My ass is getting too nervous. <laughs> Back with the Y2K glasses. Important note for the concert. We are operating by Twitch chat rules. We're not mentioning K-pop. We took our photo cards out of our phone case in replacement for uh, Polaroids that uh, make it look like they're our boyfriends. And uh, I took Dino off my bag and I'm not ever gonna explicitly say day six. I'm just gonna say the band. Twitch chat rules, okay? Twitch chat rules to make Jay feel comfortable. Hey gang, I feel like I could cry. <laughs> no concert has ever um, no made concert. me feel like, no concert. <laughs> no concert has ever um, made me feel like I could cry before it. Not even DPR. And DPR had me um, in a way, Forked up. But yeah, I might cry. <laughs> yeah, I might cry. Okay, we're gonna go back to the venue now. Oh my god. Show your bracelet, bro. I took it off already. You freaking suck. <laughs> Ice on my wrist. I'm the nice guy. <laughs> you got the right body and the right mind. Freaking Pac Man. Vlog. Be honest, vlog. Be honest. Hey, vlog. We're nervous about the security of our of our VIP tickets. I'm scared. It'll be okay. Damning freaking Jay. <laughs> My last search. Dude, are you kidding me? <laughs> you could be like, oh yeah, I just DM'd you on Instagram, dude. <laughs> Open it right now. <laughs> this account can't receive messages because they don't allow new message requests from everyone. He said, fuck you, dude. Hey. What I the hell? Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> He'll get back to me. <laughs> I'm sure of it. We're finally in the VIP line. It is dark outside and every bitch on the planet is in the VIP line. $150. Exactly. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Dude. I feel like... But thanks so much for coming. We hope you guys have a great time. You okay? Thank you. 
Words fly to this with the two of I do want to say genuinely from the bottom of my heart, um, it's kind of cringy to call myself like a musician, but like, like I, I kind of do music, that's my thing, right? And I, I just want to say, I, I really, us people who do music, we cut the records, we talk to the CEOs, we have the boring meetings, we do all this internal struggle of, is this song good enough? And you go back and forth on the song for eight months, and you're like, all right, screw and you release it. We do all of that for these moments, so thank you so much for being here. And then all of a sudden, all of a sudden there's a song. It was a lot of shit, maybe, to talk about. But, oh, quite a bit, probably. Um, it's just ADHD. That's all it is.
candidate, that's okay. We're gonna sing one last chorus together. We're jumping like we're mad. We're jumping like we're Official cue to meet Mr. J. Mr. E. And I, I got you something. I'm allowed to give you a gift, right? Okay. If I can get it off. It's key button. Oh my god, this is such a move. Thank you. I also got a tattoo for your song. I designed. I just got it like two days ago. My friend is tattoo artist. I'm just supposed to It's a hug, man. Can you do a Okay, so here he says to me twice, Nihongo? Um, inquiring about my phone because it is in Japanese. Um, and I say, huh? Both times, making it seem as though I don't know Japanese. I do, Jay, I'm just stupid, okay? Did not expect these to speak Japanese to me. So we just met him, um, first thing, went, went in for a hug, and then I said, I've been listening to you for eight years, and um, I gave him my little key, I never even showed them the fucking keychain, <laughs> I bought him this keychain. to pick with you. <laughs> you said you have a phone to pick with him? Why you? I have a phone to pick with you. Oh, Why was it safe in the rain on the list? It was. I had to... I have to pull that one out. Do you want me to sign it for that, by the way? Um, I think I'm good. I have to sign it. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah. You want to do the picture? Yeah, yeah. He gave him the keychain. He was like, I'm going to put that on my backpack. <laughs> Shut up! I showed him my tattoo. Like, he's like, that looks fresh. And I was like, yeah, I got it two days ago. He's like, good, you need to wrap it up. And I was like, it's fine. <laughs> and they took a picture of it and they posted it on a story. And this is a screenshot of him posting it on his actual fucking Instagram story. My my arm, my bumpy little arm, my scaly little chicken arm. It looks like there's blood on my hands. I promise, it's my lipstick. <laughs> I'm frazzled right now. I haven't had a chance to cry yet. I think I want to cry whenever I have my ramen later. <laughs> what the fuck did you say to ruin his day? <laughs> he said, bring it in. I was like, oh, okay. And then like, as we were hugging, I was like, I got a bone to pick with you. <laughs> and he said, he said, what? And I was like, you didn't put safe on the rain on the set list. <laughs> and he goes, it was gonna be. And I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he asked me if I want anything signed. And I said, I, th I think I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> now he thinks you hate him because he didn't perform safe in the rain. <laughs> no, but I told him I'm prime, I'm prime sub to him on Twitch. He asked for my username and I said, it's aesthetically, but you read it out and pronounced it wrong. <laughs> no, <laughs> he it's, thinks I hate him. <laughs> this is the most surreal night of my life. I probably already said this. I don't fucking give a who. I'm saying it again. I've listened to Jay Day6. I've listened them to them since they did. I can't even speak. I've listened to them since they debuted. And this is the most surreal experience in my life. Meeting one of the artists that I've listened to probably 
the longest. Eight years, that's a lot. That's that's like all my conscious time. Me when I'm about to cry though. Me when I'm tearing up. This was kind of the craziest and uh, one of the best experiences of my entire life. Meeting that fucking goober that said he'd put my little banana cat keychain on his backpack. That's really stupid, dude. I had to write gas on this guy. <laughs> so I doodled it and tattooed it on my body. He was had to have two really cute cats. So I give you keychain, freaking loser. I'm freaking poser loser. He's not a poser loser. He was really, <laughs> he was really nice, even though you threatened him. Freaking, I didn't. I you, didn't threaten him. You threatened him, dude. How did I threaten him? You said I got a bone to pick with you. Those are fighting words. And I had a great freaking time. I don't know why he would be watching this video, but thank you. Sir, post more pictures of Peba in the Instagram group chat thing. We're at our sleeping spot of the night, and I have a freaking yakisoba, and I'm watching Batty SMP to clear my mind. The next three months will be depression. <laughs> I will not overcome this event. Oh, I gotta show you the shirt. We both got the tour shirts, and it has freaking Peba on it, peanut and butter, and it's really cool, and the front looks looking like this and it's really cool and i like it and this was ultimately a life-changing experience um that i will be thinking about in a longing manner for months truth be told i'm gonna clean my freaking face and then tomorrow this is not just a concert vlog i'm going to the freaking atlanta aquarium and i'm such a bad vlogger i should have told you that this is happening <laughs> um we're going to the freaking georgia aquarium also known as the home of the only whale shark outside of Asia. Whale sharks are one of my favorite animals besides raccoons and tigers. So I'm freaking hype as heck and I love aquarium. Also, Hoshi. But I'm freaking excited to go to the aquarium. I'll see you freaking my bloody looking finger. That was not much better. I'll see you, I'll see you freaking tomorrow when we go to the aquarium, dude. Also, I accidentally cut my finger earlier. Whoopsie. It is the morning after. Really did not get sleep. I was woken up by maintenance men, and my smile lines are the worst I've ever seen them in my entire life. So thank you, Jay. I'm going to put on my freaking my freaking clothes and get ready, and then we're gonna go to see the freaking fishies at the freaking aquarium. And I'm very excited about that. Also, I wish I got sleep. And I hate to say this, I miss you, Jay. You're really nice. The fishies are the topic of the day, and I'm very excited for the fishies though. It's freaking fishy day, not Jay day. Fishy day. We're freaking dressed and ready. <laughs> and we're gonna go to the freaking aquarium. Also, look at my whale shark. He is an accessory. I'm kind of like too turt Tony in this situation. I'm using a whale shark as an accessory. See, Hanji Sung is an accessory. <laughs> and we're going to the freaking aquarium. So we're saying bye bye to this. We're saying hold on hand to this freaking place um, where I slept. And she slept and we slept and then I didn't get to sleep because a maintenance man came and fixed the shower. But now we're going to the aquarium and there's no maintenance man to fix showers there. <laughs> so maybe I'll get to sleep there with the fish. Uh, you're sleeping with the fishies. Okay, we're gonna go to the aquarium now. <laughs> Good, but it's really sweet, but I'm just not really good with sweet things at first. <laughs> it's good. Look at our little toes we're walking to the freaking aquarium. I brought friends to see the fish. I brought a photo card of Win Win. I brought Jungu and then Hei Chan, who's always in my phone my phone case because I'm always carrying his love with me. And Dino. Dino <laughs> and a freaking Ranko. Everyone's gonna enjoy the fish. like my whale shark. Oh, oh my camera. They're freaking sharks, I'm so excited. I'm not flashing nothing. It's a, it's a, it's a shark.
I'm so freaking happy. We're gonna come back and say goodbye to them. I love the freaking sharks. Pimps of the world. <laughs> I love these little freaking guys. If a beluga was a dog, a beluga would be the whole thoughts. <laughs> None. Good. Whoa. Icky guy. They're gonna kiss. These guys are freaky. No, literally. If these fish were NCT members, which would this guy be? I don't know. Ten. Okay. <laughs> if he was an NCT member, who would he be? Mark. I was gonna say Jay Hyun. <laughs> Shark did a big dip and I got a good picture and I love him. He did it for me. Thanks, man. 
crime and all the other fishies and we sat there for an hour and a half. We're in the freaking whip. Day is done and we're done at the freaking aquarium and now we have to drive many hours back home. <laughs> let's let's do a, a quick haul of the things we got. So I got this guy. I named him Sungmin because I said so. <laughs> Finn. Freaking Finn. Got this whenever we came in because we took a picture at the, at the top. The top. And so they gave us a little beluga whale. I got a whale shark one. Whale shark. And then we got her picture taken. And they well shark sleeve, and then there's a beluga. <laughs> sorry, got my favorite guys on the mind. Beluga. There's a whale shark on the inside, and then we got our Horangi hey freaking photos from the entrance, dude. Horangi. Horangi. The aquarium was freaking greatest. I cried when I looked at the whale shark, and I loved him so much, and I love him, and he was great, and both of them. There's two of them, but I loved them, them so much, and that was life-altering experience and I loved it and I had so much freaking fun at the aquarium. The aquarium. I love freaking aquarium. We go get um, gas and snacks and we trek on home through the freaking mountains and such. But through the sun. Sun? I only do my best for the whale shark so it's back to my worst. That's a good channel. Ted Nivison in that regard. I have a Bucky sticker on my car. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so we're at freaking Bucky's, and this is my first journey to freaking Bucky's. Just took a be real of Bucky's. Okay, <laughs> let's go inside. Bucky's haul, uh, Snadwitch swatch. We both got Snadwitches, chicken Snadwitches. And you got a little treat. I got a something. I don't know how to pronounce it. Kolachi. Kolachi cream cheese yeah. variety. And I'm gonna swatch this chicken sandwich in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> in difficulty, a four. Taste an eight. It's pretty good. <laughs> swatch the sandwich and tell it and swatch the rating. Swatch. Here's my bite. <laughs> the best chicken sandwich I've ever had, but I've only tried like four chicken sandwiches. Mm. At eight and a half. We should be good with a good morning. <laughs> I'm Brett. I'm Lake. Exactly. And every friendship, I'm Brett. Official um, uh, outro later. Do you have any closing words, madam? Meow. Is that it? <laughs> Wait, let me think for a second. <laughs> My friend Ash drives like they've never hit a deer before. <laughs> Do you know what I, I have? <laughs> no, it hit me. He hit me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ash got the job done. Didn't get pulled over, didn't hit any animals, almost hit a man on a scooter. That was not my fault. He <laughs> drove into the middle of the freaking road. That was him. Only hit a few curbs. Hot girls hit curbs. Okay. Okay. Is that your, your actual closing words? Yeah, those are my closing remarks. Okay. Hello. It's been a few days since the concert. Um, I'm in the process of editing the video right now, actually. 
and I wanted to do my super cool outro moderately emotional. This concert, every experience of this trip was kind of otherworldly. I have been saying this as I describe it to people and like the importance that this concert felt for me. Jay and the band are some of the artists that are the most long runningly listened to for myself. I know that doesn't make any sense. It's like excluding the Beatles and stuff. Cause like the Beatles, you, you're you subjected to the Beatles no matter what. Willingly, I think day six and consequently Jay are, is the, are the artists that I've voluntarily been listening to consistently for the longest amount of time. Meeting him and going to this concert was very life-changing and it was um, very important for me to see how kindly he treated all of us and the crowd um, constantly in intermissions between songs um, just thanking us for being there and saying that we're having we're doing great as if we need to be hyped up ayo crowd you are performing great you're performing great sir but literally whatever it was a little surreal seeing him in front of me i was like oh. seriously amazing his power the way i've had an unreleased track i'm still mad and i shouldn't be stuck in my head for four cents uh, he put those freaking videos up one of the most important concerts that i'll ever go to kind of one of the most important events he was so nice to everyone myself it was so great talking to him i hope that the next concert he has i get to go again and talk to him again because he was seriously so nice to talk to even if on twitch on his twitch stream last night he called me a motherfucker <laughs> he called me a motherfucker and guard at me for telling him to use pinterest.com i forgive you because you were nice to me in person okay we can't forgive to get props to the freaking whale shark um whale sharks are my favorite animal ever i did not really think i'd ever get to see one um in person i cried like four times <laughs> i love that freaking guy he made me so happy it, it, it's just a freaking guy swimming in the water which arguably is what you could have said about me in high school when i was on the swim team the last few years have been really sucky and things like jay's music day six and just like these little things Brad's not about to cry so second end have very much helped me so uh why am i crying jay don't watch this part if you watch the video skip it skip this part please oh my god this is i didn't think it was that serious i feel like there's not tears all over my face for the last few years it's kind of really sucked so i really wanted to give myself a trip because now i'm a little bit more <laughs> Uh, financially stable, not necessarily mentally. I did go to a J concert, an E concert, sorry sir. I allowed myself because I knew this trip was important, I was doing important things that I, I could do some fun stuff. Fun stuff like getting VIP tickets to meet the freaking guy. I love all my other trips, but I just, I kind of had to limit myself and I liked that this trip I let myself just have girl time. So um, in short, if the whale shark is watching this video, the whale sharks, there's two of them. Thank you. If I could buy you a little hat to wear under the water, I would. Uh, if Jay's watching this, I don't freaking know if you would even bother. Um, too much talking about K-pop shit, but um, thank you, sir. Uh, thank you, sir, for doing your stuff and your slang. And um, I mean, your Twitch chat like every every time you stream. And my name is Anzuzu Su. So remember me next time, maybe. So thanks to all the parties involved in making me tear up just now. A giant fish and a grown man. Thank you, that's my sincere <laughs> sign off. I don't think you guys have to get emotional. That's crazy. It's like emotional moment. Okay. Um, thank you for watching. I hope you had so much fun watching and you can subscribe, you can like the video, you can comment. Just chit chat with me in the comments. Literally you comment, I read the comment and I respond. That's the natural order of things. So you should do that. And I hope you had so much fun reliving my out of body experience and I hope you subscribe and you return in the next thing and you can follow my socials my main instagram and in the bio but also my art instagram where i post all the art that i make on my channel dude and he's like 
and you're gonna have fun. And you can say goodbye to Jay the Whale Shark. Goodbye. I don't wanna do an ending quote. Sorry. Consistency is out the window. No ending quote for this video. Bye bye. <laughs>